good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. What's going on, everybody? So, got an email, and it's this is an appropriately timed email because this this very subject has been on my mind lately. It's been on my mind lately, and I and I happened to get an email this morning, and I and I'm just gonna read it because I think it's pretty interesting. And th th this video is nothing but the truth and this video is to help people namely namely the fellas namely the fellas so the email is from a lady named Kristen I'm not gonna say her last name her name is Kristen with a K with a K the email reads here we go I wanted to ask you why you think a woman would keep talking to other men behind her husband's back I'm a 26 stay-at-home mom and wife my husband caught me talking to guys and flirting with them. I never intend on meeting any of these guys or physically cheating on, on, on my husband. Dot, dot, dot. It's like I need attention and I know that's horrible. He has caught me talking to someone and has left me and threatened to divorce me and everything. I have cheated on him. I have cheated on him in the past. Okay, so you don't intend on cheating, but you fucking did it. You fucking stupid. I have cheated on him in the past, so he thinks I'm gonna cheat on him again. Yeah, I bet he does. I bet he does think you're gonna cheat on him again, huh? No shit. Which isn't the case. Bullshit. Yeah, you're definitely gonna cheat on him again. One hundred percent. Maybe not tomorrow. Maybe not next month. But bitch, you are gonna do it again. I'm not done with this email. So basically, there are already trust issues in our marriage. We got married very young. I was only 20. Why do you think I seek out attention like this? I really don't know who to talk to about this since I don't want anyone knowing about the problems in our marriage. Well, too late for that. That's why I emailed you. Hopefully, you don't just say I'm a whore. I love my husband and I want our family together. He's getting fed up. So I, so, so I replied... And obviously, my, my reply in my email was not like it would be in a video. I, I can much better articulate myself uh, uh, via speech, via video, rather than just emailing somebody. So, I don't think you are a whore, Christian, but I do think you are a woman. So, I want to talk a little bit about this. Women, the, I, want, I want everybody to listen to what I'm saying. Take some notes if you have to. Um, it is in a woman's nature... And I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna adjust my glasses so I look like I'm super educated on the subject. But I know from experience, and I know I'm right. It is in a woman's nature to seek out the bigger, better deal. It's just in their nature. I believe women do not love men the same way men love women. I personally think that women. The only men that women are faithful to are their sons. The only women, uh, pardon me, the only men that women will, will, will stand by through thick and thin, unconditionally, are their sons. Okay? As far as their man goes, motherfucker, you are a stepping stone. Okay? If she finds a bigger, better deal, and it, it could be anything, it could be financial, the dude's got a fucking 10 inch dick and money and he's got a car and he's he provides more security or whatever I and mean, it could be anything it could be social status it could be it could be a number of things uh you know chances are he's not gonna be faithful to you now let me let me just talk about 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 what else she said in the email she says that 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 your husband caught caught her flirting with other men now now i've had girlfriends in the past for example i took out my girlfriend this is this is years ago her name was jamie this is years and years and years ago no she had a pussy not a penis go fuck yourself um i took her out to a nice restaurant on a date and you know we we had been seeing each other for a month we're fucking every day i think things are going great um and then she sees she sees like the guy waiting tables and she's like you know he's really good looking just just that, uh, just I'm, I'm sitting here with my girlfriend. She just, she kind of pokes, me, pokes me. She's like, hey, you know, I think he's really good looking. Why, why would a woman say that, knowing, knowing that's gonna low key upset the, upset the guy, 
Okay, if I'm with a female or 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 a guy, if if I'm with my partner, my significant other, and I and I, and I admit that I'm attracted, I'm sexually attracted to somebody else, keep that shit to yourself. That's the only reason a woman would do that. The only reason a woman would say that is to make the guy jealous, to make the guy feel insecure. So a, like like to test if he's a beta or not, or to make him feel more motivated to get more shit done, I guess. But I think that's a really, that's just a really uh, sneaky, s snaky, slithering, slimy way to talk to talk to a man. To say, oh, I think he's, oh, I bet he's got a big cock too. Ooh, ooh, he's got big shoulders and muscles and ooh. Right in front of your fucking boyfriend? You're not a whore, you're just a fucking woman. What else can I talk about? You know, you say you say you never intended to cheat, but yet you cheated. Let me let me say something to all the fellas out there. Let me just say something. It seems like in the movies and the TV shows and in life, when a man catches his girl cheating, it seems like the man who was cheated on wants to attack the guy that fucked his woman. Why? It's not the man's fault. Listen, unless your girlfriend or wife was raped, she cheated. Simple as that. I'm going to say it again. Unless your girl was raped, like held down and forcibly fucked against her will, that bitch fucking cheated on you and she wanted to. Don't believe, don't, don't fall for a woman's cry. Don't fall for the tears. They have much, much easier access to that emotion than men's do. Uh, than, than, than men do. I'll say it again. They have much easier access to pull out the tears. <laughs> it's he raped me <laughs> bullshit they have easier access to the to, to the crying okay they have easier access to those to those uh, set of emotions so if your girl you know was with another guy and she was not raped she definitely wanted to fuck him 100 percent and the biggest the biggest the biggest qualm I have with this email is that she says she says they got married she says she got married at 20 years old. Now, I know some people, and I know some people are watching this video right now that know I know about. What's up? I know. I'm not going to say anyone's name, but you know. You know. <laughs> you know. Um, who got married way too fucking young at 18, 19, 20. I've never, I'm trying to think here, I've never heard of a couple that got married that young and didn't have affairs going on didn't have some fucked up cheating and some some lying and some you know any of that shit going on now I'm not making this video to bash women but I'm making this video because I think more men need to need to realize that 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 they can do better I guess is what I'm trying to say like if you are a dude and your girl is t you see your girlfriend talking to other dudes and flirting with them man get rid of that bitch dude what are you doing? You're you're a cuck. She's gonna cuck you, man. Do you do you want do you guys you, you guys know what that means? It means that she's gonna be with you because you're the nice guy and you let her flirt with other guys, and you you still come back to her after she got dicked down by who knows how many dudes, you know. Even if it's just one, still, you still take her back, dude. You are a cuck. She's gonna stay with you and let you raise the kids and let you do all the work. And she'll fuck you sometimes because she loves you, right? But she doesn't respect you because she knows you're a fucking bitch, dude. She knows you're a pushover. And she's going to go get dicked down by some dude she met on Tinder or whatever. Or that she was flirting with when, you know... <laughs> oh, my God. She's she's going to bang the guy that, that waited on y'all's table the night before. Fucking God damn it, man. So it's men's job. It's it's a man's duty to understand the nature of women. Now, I'm not saying every woman alive is going to cheat on their man. That's not what I'm saying. But they toy with it. And a lot of guys do, too. But for different reasons. They just want some pussy, man. Women, dude, they, ha they, have, a, they have a much, much bigger agenda going on, okay? Now... I could sit here and tell you guys personal stories, you know, personal accounts of this stuff. I mean, I think I kind of have in other videos, and you know, I'm just gonna close out with with some points here that that I that I believe that the only men that women are truly faithful to are their sons, and I can attest because I have an excellent mother, and she's always been there. She's always been there by my side through thick and thin. 
Um, no matter how crazy I got, no matter what kind of shit I pulled, she's always been there for me. But as far as a woman being there, you know, like being my significant other, they have not been there for me. Um, I find I, I find that I love I love her so much more than she loves me, and I don't seem to realize that until after it's over. And I take responsibility for that. So in the future, if I ever do get with a woman, if I ever do get with anybody, because who the fuck knows, right? I mean. Pfft. At this point, shit, uh, it's not, ain't looking too good. Um, I'm going to go into it understanding the nature, um, and I want all the guys to, to, to do the same thing, man. Be strong, dude. You're a fucking man. Don't let these women toy with you, dude, and cuck you, all right? If, if your girlfriend talks about, hey, I think we should have an open relationship, she's already cheating on you, guaranteed. If your girlfriend uh, has dude's numbers on, on her phone that aren't you, or aren't her brother or cousin or dad or, like, gay best friend, essentially, uh, that that's other options for dick in her phone. Another piece of advice, if you're 18, 19, and 20 or something like that, man, don't fucking get married. That shit always ends up in an unhappy marriage. People will cheat because, especially, especially when you've only fucked one person. And, and, and Lady Kristen, look, your husband's a cuck, straight up. He's a cuck, C-U-K, you can look it up. Your husband's a, a beta. To, 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 to come back to you after you cheated on him and after you flirt with other dudes, like, you're, like that's nasty. That's fucked up. And that's, that's a bitch move on your husband's part. So anyways, guys, look, that's all I have to say, man. I think I made my point. Women want the bigger, better deal. Uh, that's, just, that's just how it goes. That's the unfortunate reality of it. Um, and I... And I see it happen a lot. So anyways, guys, if you guys want to shoot me an email, you want me to do a little video on you, no joke striking at gmail.com, bitches. Uh, check me out on Facebook, guys. Like and share my shit on Facebook, facebook.com slash dojocoward. Also, if you guys want to leave a little donation on Patreon and or PayPal, the links are in the description box below. If you do not want to, don't fucking do it. Peace.